um, it seemed like a very short time, 30 seconds or maybe a minute, that everyone had exited the museum and we were still there by ourselves. We saw a couple of uh, figures, apparently men in totally black um, police-looking garb, um, but it was kind of a shadow or a, a silhouette um, with guns. When I saw that, I turned around, Carol was behind me a little bit, and I hissed at her to, you know, to go. Gillian approached the uh, Tunisian woman and asked her what was going on, and she said that her children had been separated from her. And finally, it was deemed that uh, it was safe for us to make the tour around the out exterior of the building so we could enter the room. And then they escorted us around to a, a large room with a number of other um, tourists who had obviously uh, gotten out of the Barda. We miraculously ran into the Tunisian woman who we had met at, um, at the beginning and she was with her two teenagers and that was just so heartwarming and the smiles on their faces could not have been bigger all three of them it was just amazing and we were just so happy and so relieved to see that she had been reunited with them and that they were totally safe when we were leaving the security area i was just so struck by there were hundreds and hundreds of people with smiles and ovation and uh, clapping and, and applause. Pushing against the fence as close as they could with good wishes for us. They were cheering, they were clapping, they were yelling, um, they were throwing kisses to us, um, they were thumbs up, they were high-fiving. It was just amazing, the support. And you could see that they were all very, very sad and very sorry that this had happened and it certainly wasn't anything that, um, that they would ever want to happen in their country. People should know that the Tunisians are very friendly and the countryside is beautiful and it's well worth, it's well worth seeing. And who knows what's gonna happen. Um, I believe that what happened here could have happened in any country in the world. If I had the opportunity and was invited back here and felt like coming, I certainly would come back. Come to Tunisia. Tunisia is beautiful. It's it's gorgeous. The people are kind. It's fascinating. If you like history, if you like Roman ruins, this is the place to come. Uh, the mosaics are incredible. The people are kind. The food is fantastic. The sea, oh, it, it, the, the the sea is beautiful. And it, this city, Busaid, is gorgeous. This is, I love Tunisia.